Hello, my name is Pete Taylor and as my contribution to Sourdough September, I'm going to be doing a Sourdough Baking Day at the Heron Corn Mill in Beetham this September. Um, I'm going to need a rye sourdough culture and a wheat sourdough culture so that we can make a variety of bread and today I'm going to be starting from scratch my rye sourdough culture. So all I need for this is some organic rye flour, some fresh water, uh, digital scales to make accurate measurements of what I'm putting in, a uh, nice clean container with a lid somewhere to, um, to keep my sourdough starter in and um, some, a spoon to stir it and a glass jar to do some weighing with. So I'm going to start off with um, 25 grams of rye flour. Now it's important to keep the measurements accurate so that you know exactly how wet your dough is going to be when you make it. So I'm putting for five parts of flour, I'm going to put seven parts of water. So for 25 grams of flour, which I'm just putting in my tub now, 24, 25 grams, and then I'm going to add 35 grams of water. And I'm going to weigh the water separately so I get it absolutely accurate before I add it to my pot. So I'm going to go for 35 grams of water. That's slightly over. So now you see I can take a bit, little bit back and I've not got into the, not put too much water into my pot. So there we are, 35 grams straight in and that's it. There's no yeast involved in the sourdough starter because there's wild yeast, that's what it's all about really, it's the wild yeast on the flour. So give this a stir, make sure all the flour is taken up by the water and it's a nice porridgey consistency and that's how I'm going to keep it um, right the way through the process of feeding it and knocking it back and throwing some away, uh, feeding it again, getting it ready so it's really very active and also it's had time to settle down and become a well behaved starter. Uh, so that should then be ready for baking with my sourdough Saturday in September. Tomorrow I'm going to show you how to how I how I go about refreshing my very dormant um, wheat culture. But what we've done this time is um, five parts of flour, seven parts of water in a tub, put a lid on when I can find it, and just leave it in the fridge. It'll be fine. We'll come back and feed that again tomorrow. See you then.